Our love story. It all started with coding and coffee. It was during our tutoring sessions that I learned how kind, patient, and attentive you are. What you mean to me is so much more than I could ever put into words. Caleb and Elena, you're both very fortunate to have found each other. In this day and age when trust and love are so frequently tested, it is good to know that you too feel safe in each other's hands and each other's arms and that you can count on each other no matter what the situation. What I love about you is your heart and soul. You always choose what is best for the both of us and our children. When I first met you, I knew you were a keeper when you took me for a long walk on the beach under the moonlight. You told me what you were looking for in a relationship and we learned that our values aligned. Friendship, loyalty, respect, spontaneity, creativity, passion, and above all, love. We met over and over and over. Like, I'm already getting... The first time I met Caleb, I was working at Starbucks. She was working at Starbucks and we were talking for a little while about what we do and stuff. Then later on, she ended up working for the same company I was working for and that's when we like connected on Facebook. But I ended up leaving the company and I started studying code and I needed a lot of help and I was struggling. And I asked him for advice and he's like, well, if you need help, I can help you. I commented on her thing saying, hey, yeah, I could help you. And she goes, oh, cool, when are you available? I'm like, right now. We just kind of started to hang out. Just hanging out and stuff, I was like, oh wow, she's, yeah, I sure wish that we could go out or something. We always just really enjoyed spending time together even before we were dating. It was just kind of like a natural transition. It was kind of like from the moment we really started dating, I was like, yeah, I definitely want this to go somewhere. <laughs> There was always something new going on with Caleb. He was never satisfied. The status quo was just not for him. You know, to put it in layman's terms, his brain is always about three espresso shots ahead of mine. But you know, to bill him as a guy who just does interesting things is a disservice, ultimately. He's also someone who cares very deeply about others. If you need something, he will give you the shirt off his back and do everything he can when you need it the most. He's probably the first guy that I've been able to completely be present with and I don't have to be worried that he's gonna judge me for telling him what's on my mind. So for the first time I just feel safe. She challenges me to look at things in a less analytical way. Kind of obsessive about work stuff so challenging me to like let loose and have fun. Be less of a robot. <laughs> I love his heart. He's very kind, just very genuine, sweet, he's super thoughtful, just always thinking of others, he's super sweet with the kids. I remember being hesitant to let him meet William. I never wanted to introduce him to someone unless I knew that it was a good fit. I remember it was probably a few weeks into us dating, he brought up William. He was like, am I gonna get a chance to meet William? If you may not be ready, I understand, but I do want to meet him, and I understand that you're a package deal. So when he said that he knew that we were a package deal and that he would have the both of us, I knew he was the one. Oh, wow. That's so beautiful. Look very handsome. I know on behalf of Elena and Caleb, they're really happy that you're here today. And so now we're here to witness them becoming husband and wife. William, do you present this beautiful mom and bride 
And Caleb? Thank you. Thank you. Elena, you mean more to me than anyone, and I'm so happy to be standing here to marry you today. I love you so much, and I promise to always try to be the light, color, and music in your life, as you are in mine, to always support you and love you, to always help you find things when you lose them. <laughs> That's so true. I promise to always love you, no matter how many times I have to pry you away from your work computer. You are always so dedicated to all that you do, and our little family appreciates it so much. I am the happiest <laughs> man in the world today because you agreed to share your life with me. I promise to love and respect you and to always comfort you and encourage you. You are the man of my dreams. I promise to love you forever and always put God in our love first. He's such a great dad. He very much treats William like he's his son too, like he's his blood. And what I like about him is he's smart and he teaches stuff to my mom. They keep helping me through life. And I just love them so much because they always help me. I had an apartment that was basically bare. And then she just adds the color and the music to life, like in everything and cooking together and cleaning the house is like a dance party. <laughs> I feel it now, oh, I feel it now, I feel it now, into my feet, out through my crown, I feel it, I feel it now. I'm so happy and excited for the man Helena has found. It feels like he is the yin to her yang. Such a serene, patient, generous man. They complement each other so well that I am sure she has found her penguin. Here's to happily ever after. Congratulations, mommy and daddy. I'm very happy for you. And today life has been very easy for us since Caleb has been around to help us. Because you said some very special and encouraging things to one another as promises and vows, it's my honor to pronounce you husband and wife. Caleb, you may kiss your bride. expected to have this really positive family dynamic. Caleb's an amazing dad. His parents are amazing. That's why he is the person that he is. On this day, I am super excited to get married. I have a graph on my Apple Watch of how much the anticipation is like, it's just, I'm just very excited. It's amazing. I feel it now, oh. I love you and I'm ready and I'm just excited. I knew I wanted to be your wife a long time ago, but I was afraid. I feel like I've opened myself up in the past and just gotten hurt because I was honest about my feelings. I'm just so happy that I found you and I just can't wait to spend the rest of my life with you. I feel it. Oh, oh.
Keep some smiles. 